So first of all, with Samba, you start with the follower right in front of you. And actually, we're standing toe to toe, OK? My arm is going to be across the follower's back. And we're going to do basic. I start left, and she starts right. And we're going to go step together, break one, and step together, break two, and step together, break three. Now I'm going to do a box. I'm going to go side together, come forward. I go side together, come back. The ball is going side together, come back, and side together, come forward. When I do something like a saida, or in this case a ganshu, it's a way of getting the follower outside partner. In this case, I'm going to make her do the box while I stay here. I'm going to step with my right basic while she goes side with her left. She goes side, step, come back. Now you notice we're outside the partner. Now I'm going to use the box pattern to, break, to bring her back in front of me. I do a basic left, and she takes her right foot and goes side, step, in. I'm going to do that two more times. She does a box to the left. She does a box to the right. My arm is making her do this. And I make sure to step outside part of me. You notice my left arm isn't even involved. I'm just doing this to show you that my right arm is the thing that makes this happen. Okay? The reason why I want the follower to be out here is so I can start doing special moves like homari. And then I can use this box pattern to bring her back. And that is our quadrado box Ganju or Saida, and a little bit of Omari.